Hello YouTube friends, it's me Theosha Talks and today is Spa Sunday. Okay, not really. I'm just dubbing it as such, but what I'm going to do today is give myself a foot peel. This is something that I picked up at my local Kroger store for like five bucks. Um, one of those times that I was shopping and I just haven't tried it yet. Now this is one of those deals that you put it on your feet for like an hour and a half. I might just go an hour. I don't know. An hour and a half might be too long because it peels your skin off. Not immediately, but over the course of like a week, your skin will peel off and then you're supposed to have like these brand new baby feet. Listen, it's summertime. I'm not trying to be in anybody's pedicure chair right now. So I'm trying to do things on my own. And yeah, I found this like months ago. I just haven't even just haven't used it. And I should have used it months ago because it's summer now when I should have used it before and had baby soft feet going into the summer. And then that way I could have worn my sandals with confidence. So anyway, I'm going to show you guys my feet and like, you know, part of my process. So give me a second. Okay, so there are my feet. Um, I threw some nail polish on my toes. You know, like I've been polishing my toes throughout the winter and now. Um, but, you know, the skin around my toes and everything just hasn't been buffed the way that it would be if I was getting regular pedicures. I'm a little upset about that, but I'm going to be all right. Um, next to that is my foot spa. I bought this as a birthday present to myself and I've never used it. So I figured, why not now? Um, it's a home edics, um, one that I got from Target for probably, I don't know, it was under $20. I think it was on super sale and I think I ended up paying like 10 or 15 for it. Um, it came with, uh, with an instruction booklet that I have not read because I'm a little bit trifling. And then it also comes with these other two like little heads that go right there. I'm going to leave that one on there. I might change it into the little bumpily one because being that I'm doing an exfoliating, foot mask where my skin is going to come off eventually maybe I don't want to do anything that's too rough with that anyway so this is what it looks like it's pretty savvy foot peel and I've got you're not supposed to do anything for like an hour so I've got my towel I might take my polish off beforehand this is for to rinse off afterwards it's hot now but I do have like a, a an electric tea kettle hooked up nearby so that I can uh, reheat my water if I wanted to okay when I opened up the package, there was a smaller package with the little booties enclosed. So it's sealed off because I guess they must have some kind of gel or something on them. Well, of course they would. And you cannot tear that in. So let me turn it around to the other end. Take out the booties here. And then it also came with stickers. And these stickers are to adhere, you know, to close up the booties around your feet. Oh, these are pretty nice size. I didn't know how big they were. And a friend of mine was like, oh, well, what if they're not big enough? And I was like, oh, I don't know. Oh, well, you can tear them open, hopefully. That tears it open. If not, I need to go get some scissors. Dang it. Dang it! <laughs> Found some scissors. I'm gonna go ahead and cut these open. Let's get that open. And then stick your foot in it. <laughs> this is so <laughs> weird, guys. Okay, here goes nothing. As you can see, I decided against um, taking my nail polish off. Oh gosh. <laughs> my foot might be too big for this. Hold on. Oh shoot. Well, there's that. And I don't know how I feel about this. It's like my foot's all squished in there, but I don't think it's squished in there right. Let me figure this out. 
Okay, I got it figured out. On the inside, it's kind of like this really thin, kind of like, I don't know, mesh sock kind of thing inside the plastic. And it's supposed to open up so that it's on both sides and then you just slip your foot in in between there. Now, I didn't want you guys seeing me struggle, so I apologize for those who wanted to see that, but um, <laughs> I am a US size 10 and it was a little snug getting my foot in there, but it's in there. So anyone with a possible size 10, if you have narrow, more narrow feet than I do, this will probably be really good for you. And less than size 10, you'll be fine. So I've got the stickers on there. My feet are cozy in here and we're going to let the enzymes do their work. And so I will just sit here and let this do this for an hour or so. So I'm getting ready to put on something on Netflix and, and chill. It's been a little over an hour. I'm going to go ahead and take them off and rinse my feet off. And then it says that in the next three to five days, I should be experiencing some shedding of skin. I will document the process. Um, hopefully I'll post it. It depends on how gross it is. And um, yeah, so that you guys can see the end results. I am wanting there to be some dramatic results, but I'm kind of freaking out a bit. So I sat here for a little over an hour. I was editing another video. I didn't want to move because you can slip and fall in these when you're done with them. So they suggest that get whatever you need to get done done before you soak your feet or get your feet in there. I'm just going to go ahead and soak them. Just put this in the little basin here. So I'm going to go ahead and soak my feet for a little bit just to rinse off all of the um, the exfoliating gel. It wasn't a lot. It was cold. It felt really thin. It smells very like, I don't know, some kind of lotion or something. It just, it smells kind of medicinal yet fruity. It's a weird smell to it. I don't know how to describe it, but it does, it's not unpleasant. Um... But yeah, so I'm going to do that. I almost forgot to show you guys. I took my nail polish off and there's like a little button on here. <laughs> it bubbles up. Oh my gosh. Oh, this feels amazing. I might overflow this with these bubbles because I put in some shower gel. I didn't expect it to do all this. Okay, guys. <laughs> ah! <laughs> I'm going to turn it off. These next couple of days are going to be interesting. Again, I will document it, but whether or not I show you guys, that's going to be a different ball game because I think it might be kind of gross. And I don't know, especially since I feature a lot of food on here. Anyway. <laughs> But this is about my life. So it's the food thing just happened to happen. I mean, you've seen me cut my hair. You've seen me. I don't know what else. I've done a lot of really crazy stuff. But I'm glad that you guys are sticking in here with me. Thank you. Anyway, so I'll catch you guys on the flip. And um, yeah, talk to you later. Bye. Bye.